Good evening, YouTubers. This is Pagatichi here. So, konbawa minisan Pagatichi this all the way from Hong Kong, and welcome back for more anime previews to share with all of you. So, today's theme that a lot of you have been long waiting for, whether you know about this or not, this one is none other than the Digimon Adventures Tri Memorial Book and the company from the uh, Gakken Walk. You can see at the upper left right there. And they have did a lot of the Digimon books way back then, even from the um, season 1, 2, 3, and 4. But I'm not so certain about the 5th and 6th since I only watch until the season 4th, which is only until the Digimon Frontiers. So before I will show you this book, and you can tell that I actually covered it in the shiny effect, you can tell. So that means I will not be able to uh, show you the ones that's inside, like without the cover. So I do apologize for this. But to show you the um, book itself first. Uh, this one is 1,000 yen, but because of the shipping uh, sake from Japan to Hong Kong, I had to pay this for 130 instead of like uh, 100, it's 130 Hong Kong dollars. And then here's the front, and this is a perfect timing to share and do the preview on this because this is the theme where they wear their kimonos and now the season is actually autumn. So before I will show you that book of the Digimon Adventures Try, I actually got some books, some of them are from the datas like that like not really memorial book but you can see this word like you see them in the profile i actually bought them this a few years ago some of them are like you know comic strips or from the movie scenes like that and then there's even one that's similar to this which is the uh, gakken mog uh, anime media special this is the digital adventures which is similar to this one but because this one is focusing only digital adventures so you see they have the posters, you see the contents, everything in it, even the charts. Very simple but it's still good. They explain a lot of these ones. So I'm not going to show a lot because you know, even here they will show what's the, what are the concepts, what are they like that etc. The one right here is also in Japan but because it's translated all into um, Hong Kong, the Cantonese version. And the cover was gone, I apologize for that, and of course this one. And then for here, they have a poster as a touch along. And you can see, again, for the Zero Two, all of them is written in uh, Chinese. But you can tell that the, um, the screenshots, the, you know, the characters, everything, it's all in, you know, Japan. And I do apologize yet again that it looks so weird. Even the book is so torn apart, so I had to find a way to cover this without any more damages because I'm more concerned with this part. And then there's one, it's not really a Gakken Mok, but it's like a magazine. But at the same time, it's not really a magazine, so I kind of clarify what are they. But these are like kind of a sticker books or games or a mini information like that right here or evolution charts. So I these ones that you can see right there, uh, right now are focusing based on the Digimon Adventures, uh, I mean Digimon uh, Tamers and Frontiers. So those of you wants me to do a preview on these books that I got them since year 2003 until 2004, let me know on the comments below because I have a bunch of these ones. They look so old but I kept this in good condition and the price, look at the freaking price back then so cheap they're like 12 um like around let's say 10 to um 30 hong kong dollars or the highest or most expensive back then is around um 40 to 50 hong kong dollars like that's the most expensive if what i can remember so without that let us now begin on showing you this book so you can tell by the concept of this book it's similar to one of the products that they actually have which is the avo file of this one so if those of you did uh, watch my uh, anime tour room i actually have the folder of this one i have it and it's still displaying on top but i cannot show you right now so if you're curious where i hang it or where i attach it um do watch my anime tour room and you'll know where i actually attach it attach the folder so you can see i don't have to explain because i already show you the uh, book but I will not be able to show you the inside because I already covered it. So as you look inside, it's similar to the um, original book. You see this part, they will show the champion. And then going to the very last, 
you see the ultimate like very very full detailed version because it's the Digimon Adventures try so before showing you the inside part you see these are all the contents from the character charts the variety the um, the scenes that they you know capture from the you know from the movie some of them you see is from the uh, chapters by chapters like the stories some of them are like the credits some of them you see are from the posters or wallpaper or even promotions you will literally see all uh, most of these ones all of these concepts that's written on this book right here you see all of 100 pages into this book so um, let us begin so you see character charts first for the um, all nine digitessence because we have to uh, remember there's Mako in it even though not very important character but she's still the main plot don't forget whether those of you like Mako, uh, Mako or not then you see some charts of the Digimons right here like Agumon so same thing for Yamato and for the rest so I'm not going to clarify everything because a lot of them has been you know it's already shown on the first six all, all of the four all of the six chapters so I'm going to brief this very quickly and because I don't owe any of the um, pictures I only have the books like that so in case if anyone's watching this video and you're trying to get the you know pictures whatsoever and you claim that that's yours then yeah you get what I mean I'm not going to say it but just for safetyness, safety cultures. Even some funny clips that I like, like here. This is very funny from the um, chapter two. And there we go. Some of them are really good. Some of them are not so, which I'll explain to you a little bit why. So carry on. And yeah, this one's kind of creepy. I don't know why they make Togemon like this. I have no idea why. Then going on to Joe. Then his um, outfit, his attire. Then here is uh, Gobumon. I mean Gomamon. Then there's Vikemon. Then here we can't forget. Some screenshots. Another evolution charts, which is so cool. Sorry about that. And then my favorite Hikri and Telmon. And good reference for me if I want to do more cosplay of Hikri since I cosplay her um, a lot lately, to be honest. Then here is Telmon's uh, evolution chart. Although there's something that I don't really like in this, which I will say it a little bit later. And then here is Meiko and uh, her partner Mei Chan or Meikumon. Then some of her variety of uh, outfits. And then here is the chart, the evolution chart of uh, Meikumon. And then this lookalike um, Foxy from the Five Nights at Freddy's, but this is still May Craft one. And then this still creeps me out, but more creepier is the um, the other form, if you know what I'm referring to, which is coming soon. And then the two characters, they're actually the original digi uh, Digidescence. And I really do hope that if the um, toy animation, if they're trying to make a new um, Digimon series, I do hope that they will make a movie or maybe a um, season that will talk about these two and the other three because it's the Digidescence that we want to know. What really happened to the original uh, five digi uh, Digidescence and what? Why, you know, why they, you know, end up going to that path. And then she became lunatic and trying to save, you know, her partner, but then epically fell. And I don't want to clarify that. All I want to know is, or hope for the best, if the toy Animation Company, if they'll make a se uh, sequel, a movie, or even a, like a few episodes regarding about these two. And that also includes the three unknown uh, Digidescence that's a lot attached along with these two. Yep, also show him uh, more again, if you can't see him. And then some variety of other characters that you see based on the movie. That also includes um, the Mrs. Yagami, or the mother of uh, Taichi and uh, Hikari. And then here are more of the, the uh, Digimons. And yep, say hello to this 
creepy uh, merge that I am still creeped out and traumatized until now. So it's still creepy. It still haunts me. Here are the sceneries, the backgrounds that's based from the uh, from chapter one to chapter six. Even this one. The mem I remember that when I went to this area. Wow, I really love the feeling when you stay in the spa. And then in this part, you will see variety of posters or advertisements that you see them in Japan or in magazines. So there are a lot of these ones, even these. And then of course, they will always put a credit, like this one you can see. They will always put a credit and the year and the month. There we go. Some scenes are very very nice but generally I love each and every one of them because you know still represents Digimon and them of course. Even the running marathon which is amazing. Winter seasons like that. Some are um, uh, inappropriate for young kids to watch this. I mean look at this so I'm just going to pass it very quickly. Even that. And here's a Christmas scene right here very cute. And yes, handsome guys. Okay, moving on. Here is the yep. This is also handsome, but this is the Valentine version. So yep, keep on the next page. Then here is like the um, Chinese New Year like that. And here's like Leomon dressing up or slash cosplay version, which is hilarious. And here's another Valentine's um scene, but only for the boys section. Then here is those two, um, Taichi and Yamato, which I know some of you will like to ship them for some um, funny reason. Then this one is also one of the uh, wallpaper or poster from one of the magazine, but I was not able to get this because I didn't have enough money back then. And then one of them, I don't see it, and but it's still here, which is so cool and funny, you can tell by the, um, the picture itself. Then here you see the uh, equipments or gadgets that the um, DJ uh, that the DJ Destins have, like Digivice, the Googles, the Guitarra, their um, Digivice, the laptop as well. And then, starting at this point, you will see the chapter one right here. But it's only two pages apparently. So this is like a diary or some briefing about each of those six um, movies. So I mean six chapters. So this is for chapter one for example remember there are two pages so yeah this is chapter two determination the first one is called reunion chapter three confession i really cried uh, a lot this one which which is a little bit emotional and you know why for one particular character then the chapter four which is lost Right here, you can see even go briefing at the moment about the original uh, Dichi which I admire for you know the, the the you know the toy animation for remembering the you know the main plot because I remember in the original um, Digimon series, uh, Jen I did mention that before they were the you know uh, Dichi Destins, there was actually the original. Uh, Digi Distance but could not save the world so I'm glad that they provided this but I do hope that someday if it will happen or if that may happen hopefully for the best even for a little sequel or a few episodes they will ho hopefully they will talk about the original um, Digi Distance that also includes Maki and uh, the teacher which you know he sacrificed himself which I cried that as well then here's the fifth movie when I went there and watched and the scene is too funny. I really like watching the scene, especially when Yamato is like scared of the ghost, which I don't know when he was scared because I don't recall that he was scared of ghosts during the season um, one and the season two of the Digimon Adventures. So I was lost in that, but the ghost story part, it was very hilarious. Then this part is where you see, you know, um, my favorite character go, you know, evil, but the ending part makes me go question mark because of that creepy um yeah this one that's why and of course yep the fifth one is the co uh, coexistent or symbiosis the word there and as for the sixth one is the bokuro minai that means our future and you can tell only again two pages just two pages and then this part 
only out of all of the you know Digimon um, series or movies this one by far has rated PG because you know you see blood scene you see something that not many people like to see blood scene or about someone's about to die so they put it rated PG which I'm glad they did that to warn the kids if they don't like to see blood or something that's so scary they rated PG thank goodness so now after that you will see some um, mini comic version of the uh, cast members trying to do the speaking as they voice out like that you see that they're very very funny some of them they you know just make a comic version but now this is not the actual them it's just you know the people who voice these characters they just put it the characters from the DJ1 Adventures try and that is very cute instead of like revealing their true face like that or drawing um, their real their actual face at least this shows more appropriate and very um, cute, convincing to even read this. Even though I don't read Japanese, I'm so sorry. Then here are some special uh, messages to the cast members, whoever did the voice of the um, the Digimons and the Digi Destins, and also includes the other um, characters that based on the Digimon Adventures try. And then some more of these wallpapers, promotion um, pictures, if you do recall of them. Or if you're lucky, if you get the wallpaper, then I'm um, good for you. I really want to get this though. Then there's more right here. Just have to be careful though. Some of them are from this. And there we go. You also get to see some of them are like from, you know, other people's posts. You know that's not really their picture and this one you don't really see it even I don't get to see it as well this one is also one of the uh, one of the magazines and they will state there like everything so if you make wonder they're all written just all the informations here this one you also don't get to see it I'm sorry I'm so sorry if I keep moving my phone and then here are the watercolor versions like you see from the adventure to the try like so there we go then here here is starting from the chapter 1 chapter 2 and I do remember I have this wallpaper so I'm still thinking whether I should uh, attach it here on my in my room or not and then here is chapter 3 you know this is really a cool artwork number 4 and all of these are like watercolors or copy markers and they done it so good then chapter 5 and last but not least chapter 6 down here and then more talks and debriefing about the you know uh, about regarding about this Digimon Adventures try everything I do I really 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 want to read this but because uh, I'm still at a very low level you know learning these Japanese so I had to really work very hard if I really want to uh, read these Japanese words and then more of these posters or promotion or wallpaper posts that's from the uh, from the very first second third fourth fifth and sixth of the wallpaper and then here is the special um, artworks and here is the two Bokuro uh, Bokumo Bokuno Mirai right here of the final chapter A and B and then here are other informations of the goods that's coming which this one's already coming and I really saw that someone did a preview on this and I really really love the evolution uh, the transformation of uh, Tentumon to Adler Capitarium 1 and my sister Natnarf is hoping for me to buy this for her but I will have to wait if my salary is enough to buy this for her and then here is Patumon to uh, Holy Angelmon which will be released on December and this is the amount in yen and then last but not least this is the one that I've been waiting for and I'm glad that this happened because this is the complete selection animation of the stage bites that's based on the year 1999 the original one so this will be released September 26 and again this is how much it costs 8640 yen so if it's in Hong Kong probably it will be around 8 to 900 Hong Kong dollars so it's not going to be cheap if you may ask me so hopefully I could get it then at the back of the page which is the last one 
video, CD, Blu-ray, and DVD, and music information. Like so. Everything information. And if you want to know more, you can go to check on this website. The, yeah, the last two right there. And then you see, that's the final part. And it's really not bad for you know buying this for 100 Hong Kong dollars, but because I bought this for 130 Hong Kong dollars because of the shipping fee, the you know shop owners you know had to purchase or order it from Japan and deliver it here to Hong Kong. So I had to understand that you know the struggle of shipping stuff and then travel from there to here. So there are actually some good points and bad points about this book. So the good part is. They actually um, put a lot of data, I mean, what I meant by a lot of data or info, at least they have put somewhat, for example, they have put the, let's see, for example, they have put these scenes like that, the locations, which is good, without the characters, of course, and then if those of us, like even me, don't have the kinds of wallpapers and but we really want to see them, the actual things in our very own eyes instead of like copying paste whatsoever you get my point there at least we could check it right here and there's some uh, information when was it released when was it uh, created like that who made this artwork at least we now know how to hunt them down like that you know in a good way like that and we get to have most of these wallpapers promotion pictures in one book so I really admire for the toy animation and other companies for putting this all of them and then even these ones that you know you don't get to see them that's really really good and then anything else uh, any good points right here I think that's the best part and then yes also to also point out about the you know the characters like you know the fifth the you know the original um, five uh, DG distance before the eight DG distance so I'm glad they also put that mini information but I do hope in the future that they will make a sequel or a mini let's say one or two movies or even a, like a few episodes regarding about the original fifth uh, original um, DG distance that could not save the world for a good reason so the bad point about this book is not enough information for example, the ones I was quite disappointed um, is the character charts. Let's say Hickory, for example, they charts for no, not uh, Hickory. I mean um, Telmon. So if you can see the chart carefully, this is you will see right. There are some scenes why they got it from the screenshot. It does not make sense. Even Holy Dramon, it does not make sense either. Where in fact, there's some other books like the God Can Unmock, but you see me having the, the Digital Adventures, Season 2, and the third book. So, try to look at these ones carefully again. And you see three of these are from the screenshot in the movie. But then, if you look at the book right here, I'll go to that page. If you look at the chart right here, there is no um, screenshot. They could have just like put this one and put this one into the book. And then for Holy Drum one, they should also have one as well. But it doesn't really make sense. So it makes me wonder why in this book they can do that. But on the try, they don't have. So even if you go to the um, other episodes, like even like these, they'll put a lot of information. Like I know a lot of you may not understand these Chinese words, but here are just like some samples or character charts like I just don't quite get it like even just a character charts like here they still put it there but overall uh, they don't have it and regarding about the um, character charts they they did not uh, provide the Digimon uh, you know the Zero Two cast members you know uh, Daisuke, Iori, Miyako and Ichijoji Kand so even how much I try to uh, browse around on this book of the Digimon Adventures um, try. I have looked all over like insane and so many times before I even decided to do this preview today or tonight because it's already past 12 a.m. here. I tried to look at even tried to read some of the um, Japanese the ones I understand or recognize their um, words because it's the same for Cantonese and uh, simplified words. I don't see them even if you try to go to the um, 
the story plot or the chapter plots, you don't really um, see or mention them or even screenshots. You don't see any screenshots uh, regarding about the for uh, season two, the uh, distance. Even the the chapter one, you don't see them. Like what happened to them when they got defeated by um, Alphamon? And then for the six, let's see, where's that chapter six? As for the six, you don't even mention about them either. Like literally, you don't see them. You only see is him sacrificing sacrificing himself to save Tai Chi in order for Tai Chi and the other eight Dichi Destins, of course including Meiko, to save the world. And then even this one, why they don't show a lot of uh, Wizamon? I mean, he was there for a few seconds and we only see his silhouette. Same thing for the season 2, so it does not really make sense to me why they did not provide even a slot, uh, even a bit of information regarding about the um, season 2 characters because I know Digimon um, Try, I mean Digimon Adventures is connected to the um, Digimon Adventures, I get it, but they should also include the um, season 2, even though what I'm referring to because Digimon Adventure, Digimon Adventure Zero 2 are still connected to Digimon Adventure Drive because remember, Hikari and Takuru has the Digivice of the uh, from the Zero 2. Let me go that back to that page if I remember that. Yep, if you look carefully right here, they have the gadgets. Look, they, even these ones. So, this really doesn't make sense why they don't have the characters. The four characters from season two. Why they can't even have that silhouette there, or mention that they have discovered, you know, the, the, you know, the um, haunted uh, moment of this, you know, the hidden moment of the evil Jane, whatever you like to say about it. Like if those of you uh, know about this movie or watch already, and you know the story of this um, Digimon Adventure story from the chapter one, two, three, four, and five, and six. I think you already know what I'm referring to, but if those of you are confused right now what I am saying or what am I talking about, it's best for you to watch the entire uh, movie or the chapters from chapter 1 all the way to chapter 6 just to, in order for you to understand what I'm referring to and why I really want them to even put just a bit of that information regarding about the, um, the 4 missing uh, Digi Destins that's based from the Digimon Adventures Zero 2. But overall, it's still a good book, 130 Hong Kong dollars, it's not a bad price, it's still okay. Some of you may think it's expensive, it's too much, well, that's, you know, Hong Kong, when it comes to currency, from Japan to Hong Kong, a little expensive, but if you buy there, um, directly, like from, let's say, from your current location and to Japan, if you buy uh, directly in Japan, of course it's cheaper, but if it's to all the way to your, you know, where you live right now, you know, from that location, from Japan to your current location, of course, you have to charge a little bit more because of the shipping fee, so you have to respect for that. So, anyways, it's still a good book, I got to admit, it's a good book, good reference for, you know, for my drawings, cosplay, or if I want to do more drawings about Digimons, I will definitely use this book, and not only for this, even for my other books uh, as well. And, you know, as always, we can't forget, for the sake for having, you know, more Digimon goods, and because you already know me that I like Digimon stuff, so this is also one of the good collections that I will definitely keep, and I will not forget about that Digivice that I showed to you just a while ago. So, before to end this video, I have that mini bonus that I'd like to um, show to you all that you can only get this uh, as you watch the Digimon uh, Adventures Try. If you did watch the uh, Symbiosis, the fifth movie, or slash co existent, you will get actually two Shishinki postcard um, signature board. This is one of it, and there's actually two. And luckily, I actually got two. So, I will get the so I will definitely display these two onto my um, drawers above, and you will see it a little bit later. Like, cause I'll do another rearrangement in my room after I display more um, anime um, goods around my um, small room. Which, if you did see my uh, video of the anime um, tour room, 
then you know what I'm referring to. But if not, then feel free to check it out. And so, if you enjoyed this video of this uh, very long preview of the none other than the Digimon Adventures Try uh, Try Memorial Book from the company of the Gakken Book. Uh, let me know in the comments below which one of the contents in this book do you like the most whether it is the character charts, the the movie charts, the story plots, the advertisement wallpapers, anything you like to mention it uh, feel free to comment on this video and if you did enjoy this video give this video the, um, uh, the thumbs up feel free to subscribe to my channel and stay tuned for more anime previews in a later future so then until then everyone see you all in the next anime preview